Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Kitty, and we are still on our pink series. I am on number five, and today I am using a 10 by 10 canvas. I do not need a base coat on this one because of the technique I'm going to try. And just so some of you that don't know, I do take the backs just to try to make it a little cleaner. And I put push pins in to keep it up off of my tray. Um, so it doesn't stick. So, um, Today I'm going to try a boiler maker. I have watched Christina Welch and several other uh, artists do it. Um, I actually just watched one of Christina's videos. So I'm going to try it and see how it goes. Um, so this is my pink and black series. So what I'm going to do is this cup here is a 12 ounce I believe and I've already put my base paint in it because then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this shot glass and I'm going to put my colors in here and then I'm going to drop it in and hopefully the black will cover it and then we just flip it so the colors I'm using today are the Lucas Krill Rose, Folk Art Metallic Rose Shimmer, Artist Loft Black, Creative Inspirations Quinecridone Rose, and Soho Rose Matter. And this, my base paint is um, the Artist Loft Acrylic Flow Black, which is mixed thinner than what my bottle paints are. So, okay. I hope I have enough paint in there. If not, then I will just pour some more. I did spray this cup with the WD-40 silicone spray to help it um, leave the cup better. I'm not going to spray this one because the WD-40 does give you a little bit of cells, but I do use the uh, treadmill silicone um, in each of my bottles, in all of my bottle paints. And um, usually, what is it, one drop for every two ounces. And if I had that right here, I would show you. But, and, and that's, that causes the cells. So, I am going to get started. Okay, I'm going to start with the Lucas Krill Rose. I hope I do this right. <laughs> the Folk Art Metallic Rose Shimmer. And I'm going to go on with the Artist Loft Black. Creative Inspirations Quinacridone Rose. I'm getting better at saying it. In the Soho Rose Matter. And then I think I'm going to do it again. Lucas Crow Rose. Folk Art Metallic Rose Shimmer. And you want to fill your cup 
the shot glass all the way up. Hard to swap black. Oh, that is a dirty bottle. Oh my gosh. Don't look at it. It's dripping. Um, Quinacridone Rose. And Soho Rose Matter. Oh my gosh. I hope I do this right. Okay. So now... I'm going to drop this in, set it right there, and hope the black goes over it without spilling over. That would be great. <laughs> Look, I did it! <laughs> Look, got dirty already. <laughs> okay. Hope I have enough paint for this canvas. Okay, now I am going to do a flip cup. So I'm just going to set that on there. Flip it over, and I already heard the shot glass fall. And it's not in the middle, so that's going to bother me. I did hear the shot last fall, so I'm going to let some of that black out. I really hope I have enough. Hmm. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, definitely not paint. Okay. I'm going to wipe this off because I hear it can be really slippery. to let some of the color out. That is a lot of paint. Like a lot of paint. I'm just doing little swirls just to get it around. Let it drain. Okay, well, we know I got plenty of paint. So <laughs> a lot of paint. Okay. So I'm going to torch it. Almost like a fish right there. Huh? Get all the bubbles out. There's a lot of paint. Okay. Okay, here I go. Ooh, that is heavy. Oh, yeah. Try not to 
lose all of it. I do know that there is a lot of paint on here. So I know I do need to get some of it off. Because if you have too much paint on your canvas, it could crack. I haven't had that happen yet. Um, thank goodness. But... Wow. It's almost galaxy-like, isn't it? Got all these little sputters out here. Let's stand back and look at it. Get on the corners. Make sure everything is covered. Get on the coloring. Really is kind of galaxy like. This over here is just really, really cool. So I hear that if you rub it really hard, it'll work, but we'll see. You might have to baby it. Okay, well, see, look, they're coming up. How cool is that? Got this really dark one right here. Just one spot. So far. So, let me clean my hands and I will torch it again. And I'm probably going to leave it because I like it. It's pretty, um, it's pretty cool. I wish there was more of the darker, uh, like the rose matter in there, but I like it. So let me give her another torch. Sometimes I don't like torching because you get too many cells and it just it kind of just takes over the painting. I like it. Okay. 
I'll bring it up for a close-up. Just kind of checking in here. Okay. Yeah, I think I'll leave it. Okay. Thank you for watching. Hit that like button for me and share my videos. I would appreciate it. Click on that subscribe button and, and that little bell right next to it and you will be notified of my next uploaded video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you on the next one. Bye!